Greetings and welcome to Pinball Help. Mike here. And work continues on this Gottlieb system aiding board. Uh, this is the MPU board that I have decided that rather than just settle for this uh, memory cap, I'm going to put this non volatile RAM on here so the memory cap and the battery will no longer be needed. We were having problems with this 5101 memory chip on here. And I thought the process of replacing it, rather than just replace it, let's throw the non volatile RAM on and can get rid of the whole battery thing right off the bat. So that's what I did. I put a socket in. You can see the RAM is here. There's our uh, socket thing. In the previous video, I showed uh, the work on that. And uh, we have a socket in place now and this non volatile RAM. So I'm going to throw this into the game. And hopefully, this should make everything work nicely. Um, I was having some weird issues with the game, just forgetting settings and stuff like that. Even though I confirmed that the memory cap was working, it was still getting glitchy on me. So everything seems to point to the, the memory being kind of faulty. And this these games, kind of these 5101s are kind of known to kind of start to fail. So that's the next thing to, to mess around with and check. So might as well try it. So that's what I'm going to do. So there we go. Um, Hopefully I'll throw it back in the game, we'll test it, and we'll see how well it works. But not too difficult to do this. You just have to you know, be diligent in replacing that uh, socket, uh, the chip with a socket, and making sure that you're, you're very careful about not blowing traces. And uh, there you have it. So for more, visit pinballhelp.com. Thanks for watching. Check it out. That is a Gottlieb System 80 replacing the 5101 memory chip with a non-volatile RAM so you don't need a battery.